Hey there, air signs, and welcome to my channel. I'm here doing your daily love reading for Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. These will just be quick daily messages today because I will be putting out your weekly messages either today or tomorrow. So, be looking for those. If you haven't joined my channel yet, please do. I welcome you to take this journey with us. So, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Let's see what you guys have going on today. One card each with a essential issue and a base for this reading. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Okay. All right, Gemini, the King of Cups. Libra, you have the Four of Cups. And Aquarius, the Prince of Cups. In our feels today, huh? Central issue is the Tower. Basis of the reading is the Six of Cups. All right, Gemini, we will start with you. So you're um, trying to get an emotional handle on things of your past, things that have happened in the past, could be dealing with kids or something from your childhood, but something is triggering this upheaval of emotions. Um, you could be having a hard time expressing your feelings towards somebody who you have a family with or, um, or you're just really reminiscing today after um, something kind of blew up in your life. Whoa. Let's try that again. Let's get your clarifier and see what's going on here, Gemini. Gemini. You're really getting a balance on your feelings, though. You're really getting a hold on it. The moon, yeah. This moon energy is really affecting you. We have a full moon um, coming this Saturday on Halloween. Um, but there's a lot of things you're trying to get through. A lot of emotions you're trying to work through. You're reevaluating what happened in my past. Why, why do I keep repeating cycles like this? Why do I keep, you know, a, attracting relationships like this? Really um, looking back at what what your life has consisted of, um, really trying to get through this energy. You could be dealing with a cancer with uh, the two cups here, but um, you're finally working through emotions after a difficult time. Today is a good day to sit and um, with yourself and really think through things. Really, you're really sorting through your emotions. That's what I keep hearing. You have a lot of feelings for somebody as well. You could be ending a relationship in order to move towards somebody who's been uh, a secret in your life, somebody who you haven't let people know that is in your life yet. Um, so you could be moving towards that next step as well, hoping to build a family with this person. All right, Libra, you have the four cups. You're holding back. You um, are trying to heal from a breakup in the past, or you're getting ready to break up with somebody, um, Scorpio. Uh, this is somebody that you are hoping to build a family with or somebody you have a family with. Um, Four of Cups. Why is it here for Libra? Ooh, Queen of Wands. Okay. We're going to take the only one that flipped. You're really, um, in, you're really thinking about somebody that you had in your past, uh, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. This is somebody that you hold up your standards to everyone else in comparison to this person. Um, this person could be very connected to the, you know, the divine, the esoteric, uh, you know, very psychic energy. But this is somebody that you um, had a family with or you wanted a family with. And you're not really wanting to move on. You're not really wanting to look at anybody else because you're very focused on this person, even though it has ended. For those of you who are not thinking about somebody of your past, you're really thinking about somebody who you want to take action and move forward with. Um, this is somebody who uh, has been waiting on you, but you're very focused on the negative instead of the positive of what you have to give up to get what you want. Um, yeah, the Eight of Wands. Heavy Sagittarius here. You are going to open up communication or reach out to a fire sign today. Um, you can't get them off your mind. This is somebody that you walked away from in the past or they walked away from you. Um, you're really thinking a lot about them. Even though it ended, you can't seem to get past them. You can't seem to get them off your mind. Um, if it hasn't ended yet, now that you're ending a relationship, you are moving towards a fire sign for you Libras. All right. Aquarius. Let's see what you got going on. You're offering your love to somebody. You could have walked away from somebody creating this tower moment, and you are heading back towards somebody of your past. Let's see what this is all about. 
the Ace of Cups. You want a new beginning. This is a lot of self-love. You've done a lot of work, Aquarius. You have really put in the hard work after this tower moment in your life. This could have been in last year in the time of Scorpio, um, or it is happening right now. But this upheaval is a blessing in disguise because it is creating this opportunity for you to self-love and to move forward and offer your love to somebody who deserves it. Um, give me one more for this Ace of Cups. This is a beautiful energy of um, making the positive out of a negative. With the Five of Wands, you have a lot to choose from. Uh, you are getting over a broken heart, however. There was too many people in this situation for you, Aquarius. So you are really focusing your love on yourself, really focusing on healing after finding out. This could have been a person of your past, and you're now finding out you know, how many months or years later that there was other people in the connection. And it's really taking you some time to um, heal, to, to put that love into yourself instead of another um, but either way, this is the positive out of the negative. I do see you offering love to somebody of your past or somebody you have a child with. You could have recently had a child um, in the last six months and you're wanting to move back towards this person um, because now you feel whole. You feel you have done the healing it needed to take to move forward and um, start a relationship on a positive note. So Aquarius, you're moving in a beautiful direction. Um, keep up the good work, the, the self-love, the... Um, personal development because it is going to pay off and give you a big opportunity for a new love coming in for you guys or offering love to somebody of your past. So, all right, air signs. I hope you enjoyed your quickie daily love reading. Once again, I will be posting your guys's weeklies, um, by Zodiac here on the channel in the next couple days. They are done. They're just uploading and in the processing or er, processing phase. So be watching for those. Um, if you want to join me on Patreon starting November 1st, I am doing daily love readings by Zodiac, so you can catch me over there every day live. Um, check out the description box below uh, for all the details, and I will see you guys tomorrow. God bless.